liberal women. Um, let's talk about January 6th. January 6th. Here we go. Oh, Break in that motherfucker. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Were those were there good people out there? Okay. Or, I mean, or was that just like a peaceful protest that kind of went left or okay. like no God. there were plans before from groups like the proud boys who had deliberately knew that, side off. that were talking about going to january 6th and trying to infiltrate the capital before january 6th had even like taken ray place Epps. ray apps i'm not sure who this you is you don't even know who but... ray apps is no i know who's that that's shocking okay, but, but he, he is a cia agent or fbi agent who was telling people on january 5th that we need tomorrow we need to go into the capitol and then on january 6th there's video of him telling people to go into the to raid the capitol and there's video of him whispering into the front lines people right before they pushed and he was on the fbi's most wanted list and then he was just suddenly taken off and now he's free to do go you know why because he he's one of them. He's a Fed. He's one a Fed. of who? He's a Fed. Oh, we're just gonna say that the like CIA. these people are like Fed psyops. You don't even know who he is. I How can you possibly claim to be educated on this subject at all and not know? I didn't who Ray claim Epps is. to be educated on January six. I said we could talk about it. That's it. That's. I didn't mind talking it's, it's about sad. it. I never claimed to know who Ray Epps is. Why do is I know all the liberal arguments and liberals never know the conservative arguments? That's not. You're attributing that position to me. I don't know what Ray Epps has, who that is, or what that has to do with this, or like sure, if he's yes, a Democrat or what. I know that you don't. Well, know who I only asked about. I only, I only brought it up is because um, we we talked a lot about black people being less smart not they're necessarily not, smart. Not, nece- not, not necessarily Zirka, not necessarily what i would have appreciated more would have been i said i read a study <laughs> she, according to Zerka. she was literally she knows the study she's just lying she's a liar finish. and she's burning in hell okay stop the burning liar let her finish her sentence i'm interested yeah so what i would have liked better would have been hearing people of color people of color but y'all made it a black thing so since you made it a black thing and since we know that that insurrectionist was more of a white thing i just wanted to know your white liberal opinion about it yeah. but it seems like you guys yeah, look like, wait, look do you like think that I believe that there are rights. racial differences in IQ that are statistically significant I only took it down to that level to try to isolate variables to see if Zerka would admit that he obviously believes that there's a racial hierarchy when it comes to IQ like obviously I mean, like, right? I'm just reading data guys really I'm just reading white people reading. were on top and I'm black just, people were no I don't know she's so stupid she doesn't remember I said Chinese people be white she's literally like a frog brain I said Chinese people be white black people I'm sorry, Please you remember that Xi Ping is beating the white guy. No, I want to know what you're saying. Like you deserve like a voice instead of Zerka like constantly. Know, being she doesn't have it. I haven't, I haven't said anything this podcast. I, I deserve to talk. But, but, you, but I got a voice. Why <laughs> tripping? <laughs> but I, I agree with you. When you look at who is the majority at January 6th, it was Trump's like bread and butter base. It was mostly like white upper middle class voters and, and supporters of his. That was yeah. who was at January 6th that day. That yeah. January, yeah. Yeah. You know what January, that January 6th reminded me? It just looked identical to the 40 BLM riots. No, it looks Except way you guys had more fire Actually, and inferno it was, it was and destruction people. and murder. People. It right. wasn't that murderous. People didn't really die. They walked around. They were like, the policemen walked them through the White House and the, the I mean, the Capitol oh, building. Oh, 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 Police oh, didn't oh, let people oh, into oh, the Capitol. Yes, they did. Did you not, no, did what? you not see the tuck? Like, did you not see what was shown on Tucker? The footage was released. No, it was extremely useful. Yeah, we def- it was Carl only Carl hours that were released by Tucker Carlson and they definitely chaperoned their motherfucking asses in there was like, all right, I watched go. the documentary. From but let somebody sit here average. and go, Black Lives Matter, we got to bring in the motherfucking National Guard. You know that they literally didn't turn evidence, like Congress didn't turn evidence over to the January 6th defendants regarding that video. They had the footage and put people in jail. But all well, the no, they did was they started to Tucker Carlson, they they like, Tucker Carlson cherry pick it and show what he wanted to pick. Two years actually. later. Yeah, to my, two years later, to my understanding, it was like a video of them actually being like escorted out, not escorted in. And yeah. then it was like edited otherwise. But I'm down to like revisit this topic, honestly. Like, I'll, I'll send you the video. Yeah. Yeah, because like the video I saw, that was the where the officer was where the officer literally grabs and jiggles the door, sees it's not open, well, he, and then goes gets another key and then opens it. That one. That he video? wasn't letting people like, in. To though. my understanding, it was like well, no, it was a door is like to exit out or like another way to exit no. out. But we no, they were literally later. going into chambers. They were opening the doors, and then no, and then weren't. during during the shaman speech, he said 
thank you to the officers who allowed us in today. Well, I think either way, those officers what? did that wrong. Like, they shouldn't have done that. It was Mossad. Just because the shaman claims something that doesn't actually it was. mean I mean, it's true or not. Okay, but why were there police officers? officers in the footage, even when the shaman was making that speech? Because they were yeah. trying to get people out. They were well, not trying to usher them then in. Then why didn't they arrest? There were more officers than there were people in that room. So why didn't At they? At that point, they weren't going to try to start apprehending individual people in the middle of a riot. There is the shaman alone with three officers and at one point he walks past i think it was seven or nine why didn't they arrest him then don't you think it would be easier to escort somebody out that's not like basically trying yes, to please, let's not arrest the criminals that broke into no, the no, temple not and, and, and started all this they shit might, let's they, not arrest them they arrested them afterwards but obviously if you're in like a highly contentious situation that's a riot, you try, yeah, to not do, a riot procedure yeah, you, you try to get people out of that building right instead of like okay if we start arresting everybody here well now they're going to protest louder they're going to get like angrier they're going to start okay. resisting so you and that's what they did they arrested those people afterwards like we see the mug shots you didn't know who you didn't know who Ray Epps was. No, did I said I never claimed to know who Ray Epps was. Okay, I was did like, did you know who Ray Epps was? was? I didn't know the specific okay, name. Do you know but who I know... Ashley Babbitt is? Are you talking about the people that? Do you know who Ashley Babbitt wasn't is? Wasn't she killed? Are you? Did she die? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's okay. How wrong. did she die? Yeah. I don't. She was shot, right? By who? A cop, right? What cop? I, I and where? The police. She was in. The Capitol trying to prevent people from breaking the glass. I don't agree that she should have died. I'm sorry that she died. Neck by I, how it's, many how many capital officers died on January sixth? I don't think anyone. Yeah, did. zero, zero I officers died on January sixth. What's, what's, I'm confused. confused this. What's the argument? I was. I, okay, I don't think it was so, right that Ashley was shot or that she died. I'm sorry about that. I like. I'm sorry that she died at the hands of like police brutality. You're not yeah, sorry. that's bad. I'm Me? Sorry. She's definitely not sorry. Absolutely Our not. Okay. What's the argument? I mean, you don't believe, she was you don't a believe veteran it. too. Just saying, she was a good. I one. know. I don't agree with it, with police brutality or, Wait, or civilians being shot by cops like that. So you feel bad she died? Yes. Do you feel bad for starving? I don't care that she's been alive with me politically. For so I feel bad that she's dead. Do you feel bad for starving children in Africa? Do you yes, feel, I'm so yeah. brave to say that I care about yeah, starving well, children in Africa. Can I ask yes. you?